gutsy road victory for us. Um, special teams were brilliant. Two power play goals, a monster one there early in the third to, to put us on top. And, um, you know, I think we had to kill three penalties in the third period, which is not a, a recipe for success. Normally for us, we're usually really disciplined, but it is what it is. We, we, we had some monster kills, and a lot of guys played really well. And um, you know what? That's a that's as good a coach team as there is in our league, and, and we knew that going in there. They're, we knew they'd be well prepared. We know they're going to be tough to play against, and you know, trying to wiggle through the neutral zone. And you know, we had to live with. You know, we we were under the understanding we're going to turn some puck over, and um, but we, you know, we kind of just found a way on the road, and um, really proud of our guys' effort. Yeah. So uh, in between periods, Langer uh, wanted us to get to the front of the net more, and. Uh, so uh, that's what we did. I went to the front of the net. Toby put the puck on net. I tipped it and then got the rebound. I just stick to our game. Uh, we know we had a couple of chances. Uh, we just needed to get one there. We got one early, lucky enough. So just stick to the plan. Uh, play a little bit more simple. Get the pucks deep. Grind them down. And just get the goals. Uh, for the power play, we were not happy giving up a shorthanded goal late in the period. And uh, we still had some time left on it. So we just wanted to come out and get that goal back and uh, uh, we were lucky enough to do that. Yeah, short memory, that's the first thing we, we talk about going into the third. We've got to have a short memory here. We got an opportunity to, to uh, validate that shorthanded goal with one of our own, and um, we did that. Guys answered the bell, and uh, just like I said, really proud of our guys here on the road today. Yeah, that's, uh, we had a couple, of, a couple of good looks there before. Uh, that's a good uh, thing about our power play. We got so many good plays. Uh, so, which makes it unpredictable. And Blake got it, came down, and Marty came up, and uh, Blake found me in the middle and just locked it in. Uh, we've been together for a long time now, and we've built some good chemistry. Uh, two of those goals coming on the power play. Uh, we have a lot of good players on our power play, so that, that helps out a lot. Yeah, well, you know what? We're getting down to crunch time here, and the ice starts to get hard, and um, you need your best guys to elevate, and you like big game Hugo anytime the ice gets hard Hugo's gonna answer and then obviously you have Blake and, and, and Toby so skilled on the outside there so um, yeah they, they played like a first line tonight and um, really really good job super uh, super good he came up with a big save there in the end which was huge uh, we've been putting a lot of trust in him lately and he's been really performing for us and feels feels great having two good goalies now and Scott's back too yeah, you, you can't go on long winning streaks without strong goaltending, and he's definitely uh, been good for us in net. And uh, especially with Scott coming back, we got two really good goalies, and we have uh, really good confidence in both of them. Yeah, he's just got a knack for the big save and, the, and a timely save, and he's he's really great at reading the game, knowing when we need a whistle, knowing when we got to keep the puck moving. And um, you know what, you get what you deserve, and no one prepares harder for uh, for a hockey game than Steph Durant. It means a lot. Uh, like I said yesterday. Uh, you can't do it without playing with good players, and uh, yeah, credit to them. It's a uh, it's a special night for our entire program. You know what? We get to, to anytime you're the best at anything, or anytime you're number one all time. Um, there's not enough words that I can have to, to do it justice. He he passes another terrific player, in Adam Pluskash. Um, but you know what? Blake was. Uh, it's it's one of those things like when you reflect on, and I went in and gave a big hug today. In the, as a coach, like I said, anytime you're a, an all-time leading scorer or you're finishing number one, you're doing a lot of things right. And the irony is, is um, I always joke around with Blake, like he, he's like a human highlight film. Most of his goals, you know, you can put up around ESPN, and that's probably the easiest goal I've seen him score in the last four years. So, um, <laughs> but really proud of him. Uh, does it in front of his dad, which is a really neat thing, and um, it's a terrific moment for our program, and we should celebrate that. We just got to stick to our game plan and. Uh play AIC hockey. Yeah, we don't touch the money. Like We're not going to sit here and, and uh, think about what we just did. It's all about tomorrow right now. And um, you know, we just got to keep putting points in the bank for our league. And that's what's most important for us right now.